everyone, so I have selected me to some and I've just been to a car boot sale. I have learned that car boot sales are not for me. I always like the sound of them, but when I went I realised it was too much. I should have known, but I went thinking I'd be okay. I didn't anticipate how many people would be there. Everyone raves about this particular car boot sale, so I went to it with my mum. And right from the start I was like, nope, too many people. There was so many cars and I feel like it was the fact that once you drove on it was a bit to drive back from there like it's not an easy route to escape from and also when you're actually at the car boot sale there are a lot of people and then with selective medium as well it's not just not being able to talk I realised I am not able to look through the stuff on the tables because I can't go touching other people's stuff because people will then see me move, which sounds ridiculous, but it's what it is. But I just wanted to share my experience because I feel like I am the only person that was there today that cannot deal with the situations and I really just wanted to put my headphones in and it wasn't even that noisy but just to have something to focus on but I couldn't because they were in my bag with my phone and that meant, which sounds ridiculous, it means I would then have to take my bag off to get them on and like to get them out of my bag, but I couldn't because sex abuse stops you from moving. Like I was able to walk, I bought some jigsaws, mum suggested them and I just gave the guy money. I was able to say thank you, like, and it came out normal, but it's just horrible and it's so like, you just get caught in your headspace. I look so sweaty and I'm not, it's sun cream. <laughs> but yeah, I just really wanted to share my experience because it was tough. And I don't know if it's because I'm going through some like family issues, so that's on my mind a lot. And also I'm back to work tomorrow after half term, so there is a lot going on. But yeah, it, car boots are not for me. <laughs> I just wanted to make this video because I feel like I'm the only one that goes through this, but I'm not. But I feel like I am, so I thought the way I could do it is share my experience online and then other people who are going through similar things know that you're not alone and that it is fine to feel how you are feeling. It just feels awkward <laughs> and embarrassing at the time. 